Well, we've got a lot of work going on. Clearly, the cars um, will be back pretty much pretty soon, and they'll strip the cars and repair the cars for the next race. We've also got the wind tunnel, which is going 24/7, um, and the designers upstairs who are building and designing new parts, and the machine shop over there when they're making the parts. So everything's being, you know, prepared. We've got new bits coming through, which we're testing. Hopefully, we'll come through positive wind tunnel. And then they'll bolt them on the car here and we'll get to test some of those at the track and through the race, next race weekend. But I suppose that we do have a couple of update packages, uh, bits coming, so hopefully we'll have a bit more downforce and performance in the next race. Well, Germany is now, what, uh, 10 days away from us and uh, it's an important uh, race for us. It's the second home race. There's a massive determination in this organisation to make sure uh, that we bounce back from that. Uh, the cars are behind me, being built at the moment, and uh, as I say, they will be leaving here uh, in about a week's time. Uh, but we need to ensure that we've uh, upgraded the cars. We have some significant packages of work which were aimed at Hungary, but uh, the organisation uh, wants to bring them forward, wants to introduce them for the German Grand Prix. That's a big effort, and there's uh, lots of people deep down in this organisation that are now pushing like crazy to make sure we can bring forward uh, that new aerodynamic package, introduce it for Germany uh, and really start the process by which uh, we move forward on the grid and return ourselves to where we expect to be and more importantly where other people expect us to be. We expect him to be you know, a good chunk quicker than we were at Silverstone and um, also have uh, some meetings with engineers and with the designers and you know, just to prepare to, uh, to a German Grand Prix to make sure that we don't disappoint our, our German fans and Mercedes people there. Every race we approach to win, we want to win. We live to win as a team. We live to win, I live to win. I get up and train to prepare myself to win. But you arrive and then when you don't win, it's a bigger knock on you, yourselves. But when you're realistic about your goals, uh, we want to win, but it's less likely it's going to happen this weekend, but we'll be around here. So when you actually don't get the win, it's not such a big knock on myself or the team. So we're realistic of where we are. However, we want to win more than ever, so if we arrive and all of a sudden we're very quick, we're like, come on, let's keep pushing.